Well, who invented the calendar we all currently use in modern society? It was invented by the Catholic Church, by Jesuit priests in the 1580s. Is Neil deGrasse Tyson right about this, that all calendars before 1580 weren't accurate? Well, the Jewish people have been keeping good time for thousands of years. In fact, the very first commandment that God gives to the Jewish people is to make a calendar based off of the new moon. We have, tracking how long it takes Earth to repeat its seasons, the year that corresponds to our seasons is slightly different from the year that corresponds to how long it takes to go around the sun. It's true. A purely lunar calendar has only 354 days, 11 days shorter than a solar calendar. The Jewish calendar should completely fall out of sync with the seasons. But then, in the book of Deuteronomy, God says that they have to celebrate Passover in the spring. This means that their lunar calendar has to align with the solar year. How do they do this? Well, for centuries, Jews had to actually witness the new moon and officially declare a new month. Okay, so maybe this wasn't technically a calendar and Mr. Tyson is right. But then the Talmudic sage Hillel created a modern fixed lunar solar calendar that accounted for both the sun and the moon around the year 358 common era, 1,222 years before the Jesuits. And the Jewish people have used it ever since.